Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is your I Forgot Live Vlog. That's why I look so fucking over here. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I don't know why I just did that with my hands, but it's okay. But welcome back. It is your girl Marley here today, and I have a brand new video for you guys. So, before we get into the video, if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button, please hit that bell button so you can be up to date of all the videos that I posted, and also give this video a thumbs up if you're returning. Welcome back, whores. We're here, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. So, today's video, it's kind of like, I don't know what I wanted this video to be, but since i finally launched my website i was like why not make a video talking about my website and kind of like a little chit chat and tell you what's been going on and why i haven't been posting consistently so good news is i finally finished my website so now you guys can now place your orders on my website at marley the artist dot big cartel dot big cartel dot com i'll put it in the description box and i'll put it like right here on the screen so at first when i was making this website well at first before i decided to make a website i just i didn't want to do it because i didn't want to make it into a business because it's just not something that i wanted to make and to this day it's still not really a business this is just something that i do for fun so a lot of people were just like hey make a website so you don't have to go out and meet people and be like oh here here's your shoes or da da da, da. you know just for my safety they're like, why don't you just make a website and just ship them out to people? And at first I was just like, nah, I'm okay because this is just a hobby. I do this because it's fun and I like to and it keeps me entertained because I love to paint. I love to draw. I love to do anything. With art. I love music. I love all of that. Little thing that you guys don't know, I used to play the violin. Huh. Cool fact about me. But <laughs> yeah, so people were just like, make a website, make a website, you would get like good money from this. And I was just like, nah, it's cool. This is just something, this is temporary. This is just a maybe a one time thing. And that was it. Because I actually started customizing shoes back in 2013. I did like maybe like five shoes. My very first pairs of shoes were some Tim's I did for a freshman back in high school when I was in high school. And she, um, was just like hey like i want to do something to my tims do you know how to do shoes i was like no but i mean i guess i can go for it i wish i had pictures of it but if i can find some pictures somewhere i will definitely show you guys but i doubt that i will because that my old phone had all the pictures of all the shoes that i did but i don't know where that phone's at i think i lost it or something but they were tims and i drew like flames on the side they were really really nice and then i add like this little stringy like little fur to the tongue it was like so nice only thing is it was my first pair of shoes that i ever did so i wasn't thinking i was like i have hot glue i have this fabric this red and yellow fabric to throw on your tims and some markers like let's do it and she loved them so she was going around school people were like who was doing them who was doing them? she was just just like this girl named marley she, you know she's in all this art classes because i was in a lot of art classes i was in pink i did i was in a lot i was in sculpting all of that shit. i was in all of that and yeah, so people were asking her, she was like, yeah, Marley does it, but you know, she doesn't customize shoes. So they're like, oh, okay, whatever. Sorry if I'm talking so fast. I just ate. And this year, I was just like, hey, I'm fucking around with my shoes. I used to do this stuff. Let me just do it. So I did some of my Vans. I'll insert a picture right here. Did some of my Vans and they were just like test runs because it was been like from 2013 to 2019. That's a big time span of taking a break from doing shoes. I am sweating taking shoes uh, doing shoes so i was just like you know we just practice on these people love them and people were just like hey like can you do my shoes i'm just like no these are just like a one-time thing because it's been a long time since i did them then my mom was just like hey i have some vans that are dirty do you feel like customizing i'm like sure and that's when i started the business my mom had some vans that she just wanted me to customize with the snoopy and like i guess the ice cream or cupcake whatever you guys want to call it the ice cream inspired vans with snoopy on them went freaking crazy i had people from my old job hitting me up like hey like let me do my shoes like come on da -da -da -da. so i just started doing shoes from since then at first i was only charging people 25 dollars for me to 
do their shoes just because like i said it's a hobby it wasn't something that i was taking serious but once i started getting more people i did raise the price up to 50 max 50 is max and that's for any anime any cartoon any uh video games any that you can see because i have my nintendo shirt on aka my boyfriend's shirt and you know that's what i do that's what my prices are now it's 50 dollars. but when you go to my website it is plus the money for the shoes because I have to go out and go get the shoes or I have to order the shoes. So on my website, the shoes and the um, the customized design is all together. And you can choose whatever design you want. You would just have to put it in the notes. I'll get it and then I will, um, you can either email me or you could uh, DM me on Instagram and let me know what you want on the shoes and we can just talk to them. A lot of people, at first when I first launched my site, a lot of people were like, why is it so high? Like. Why the prices are so high? And, and I said in the description box on each product that you click on, the shoes are included. That's why it's so high. I was like, I have to go out of my way to go get them and design them for you. I do not take in-person uh, shoes anymore just for the time being because I want my website to build up some more audience before I do that again. So that's why I think the highest price on my website is like 140. That's what shipping because air forces are like $90 and then plus $50 with it that's like already like one something so that's why it's so expensive so the shoes are included and everything and then I have like my disclaimers and stuff on there but yeah I just want to talk to you guys it's up it's finally ready and I'm ready to take more orders I already had a couple orders already this week it was been fun I'm going to actually post one of the pictures right here to show you it was for a father's day gift for a customer that she was going to give to her husband and I did these shoes and it was fun i can't post them yet because today is saturday the day before uh father's day but i will post them tomorrow when sh she posts her pictures and then you guys will see it <gasps> but it's already on my instagram but on like all my other social medias then that's where i'm gonna post it at of course but yeah so i'm really excited for this website it took me very long to even think about doing one to create it i did the whole website myself and it was so much fun and then just seeing people actually be like i'm so proud of you a lot of people are supporting it a lot of my family that i'm just like who i don't even talk to or we don't communicate anymore are like supporting and sharing it with people like hey marley's doing this she has her website out she does really nice shoes you guys should check her out and stuff like that so i am very 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 blessed and very thankful for all the support that a lot of you guys are been a lot of you guys who've been giving me the support even though i was ex at first i was kind of sad when i started the website because a lot of my friends that i thought were my friends were not really like supporting me and i wasn't asking them to do it but you know since this was such a big deal for me because this is my first website this is a business that i'm finally taking serious i'm not expecting people to realize it i was just expecting like just the i'm proud of you because i i'm always supporting my friends always and it just sucks sometimes when those friends are like hey can you post this can you post that i'm like yeah sure whatever i'll go like it i'll go comment whatever you want me to do but when it comes down to me nobody wants to post it which it doesn't bother me it really doesn't bother me but it does at the same time because it's like they'll continue coming to me and be like can you do this can you do that and it's just like okay but where where was you when my stuff dropped or when i decided to do something you guys aren't there so i was like whatever but i'm thankful for all the people who have been supporting me and i'm so happy and i couldn't be any more blessed and yeah so this video is just pretty much talking about the website and how i started customizing i'm waiting on space tv to do uh places or so he can do a review on his youtube channel i think that would be really cool he has shouted me out in his last video you guys should check him out he has really funny content and yeah so like i said don't forget to like comment and subscribe I hope you guys have a beautiful day, beautiful night, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Being a girl is so fucking hard sometimes. How the fuck did I forget to put on lip gloss? Like, who am I? I used to never do this. Uh, I never act like this. I'm usually like a tomboy. I'm all over the place, depending on airports. Wow! <laughs>